Brainwise presents Grade 5, Math, Quiz B, Part 2 Beep beep! Math alert! This is a special bulletin for all super smart cookies out there. Brainwise is bringing you a math quiz that's out of this world! Get ready for a brain-boosting adventure filled with fun puzzles and tricky questions. Think you can handle the challenge? Buckle up, Brainiacs! And let's blast off on this math-tastic journey! Easy round. Number 1. A triangular garden has a base of 12 meters and a height of 8 meters. What is the area of the garden? Again. A triangular garden has a base of 12 meters and a height of 8 meters. What is the area of the garden? The choices are A. 20 square meters B. 30 to square meters C. 48 square meters D. 96 square meters The correct answer is C. 48 square meters. Number 2. A cube has a volume of 60 for cubic centimeters. What is the length of one of its edges? Again. A cube has a volume of 60 for cubic centimeters. What is the length of one of its edges? The choices are A. 2 centimeters. B. 4 centimeters. C. 8 centimeters. D. 16 centimeters. The correct answer is B. 4 centimeters. Number 3. A movie is 2 hours and 15 minutes long. How long is the movie in minutes? Again. A movie is 2 hours and 15 minutes long. How long is the movie in minutes? The choices are A. 75 minutes. B. 135 minutes. C. 215 minutes. D. 375 minutes. The correct answer is B. 135 minutes. Number 4. Sarah's pet snake is 1.5 meters long. How long is the snake in centimeters? Again. Sarah's pet snake is 1.5 meters long. How long is the snake in centimeters? The choices are A. 15 centimeters. B. 150 centimeters. C. 1,500 centimeters. D. 0.15 centimeters. The correct answer is B. 150 centimeters. Number 5. A parallelogram has an area of 60 square centimeters. Its base is 15 centimeters. What is the height of the parallelogram? Again, a parallelogram has an area of 60 square centimeters. Its base is 15 centimeters. What is the height of the parallelogram? The choices are A. 4 centimeters B. 6 centimeters C. 8 centimeters D. 10 centimeters The correct answer is A. 4 centimeters. Woohoo! You guys cruised through the easy round like math superstars. But don't get too comfy because things are about to get trickier. Are you ready for the average round? I bet you are. Let's see if you can keep that amazing energy going. Average round. Number 1. A parallelogram has a base of 14 centimeters and a height of 8 centimeters. What is its area? Again, a parallelogram has a base of 14 centimeters and a height of 8 centimeters. What is its area? The choices are A. 20 to square centimeters B. 56 square centimeters C. 112 square centimeters D. 224 square centimeters
The correct answer is C. 112 square centimeters. Number 2. A rectangular container is filled with water to a depth of 10 centimeters. When a rock is placed in the container, the water level rises to 12 centimeters. If the container is 20 centimeters long and 15 centimeters wide, what is the volume of the rock? Again, a rectangular container is filled with water to a depth of 10 centimeters. When a rock is placed in the container, the water level rises to 12 centimeters. If the container is 20 centimeters long and 15 centimeters wide, what is the volume of the rock? The choices are A. 300 cubic centimeters B. 600 cubic centimeters C. 3000 cubic centimeters D. 6000 cubic centimeters The correct answer is B. 600 cubic centimeters. Number 3. If you increase the edge length of a cube by 1 centimeter, how much does the surface area increase? Again, if you increase the edge length of a cube by 1 centimeter, how much does the surface area increase? The choices are A. It depends on the original size of the cube. B. 6 square centimeters. C. 12 square centimeters. D. It stays the same. The correct answer is A. It depends on the original size of the cube. Number 4. You want to wrap a present that is 20 centimeters long, 15 centimeters wide, and 10 centimeters high. What is the minimum amount of wrapping paper you need to cover the entire present? Again, you want to wrap a present that is 20 centimeters long, 15 centimeters wide, and 10 centimeters high. What is the minimum amount of wrapping paper you need to cover the entire present? The choices are A. 600 square centimeters B. 1300 square centimeters C. 3000 square centimeters D. 6000 square centimeters The correct answer is B. 1,300 square centimeters. Number 5. A cube has edges of 4 centimeters. If you want to paint all the faces of the cube, what is the total area you need to paint? Again, a cube has edges of 4 centimeters. If you want to paint all the faces of the cube, what is the total area you need to paint? The choices are A. 16 square centimeters. B. 64 square centimeters C 96 square centimeters D 256 square centimeters The correct answer is C. 96 square centimeters. Wow! You guys are math wizards! The average round definitely didn't slow you down! But now, it's time for the ultimate challenge! The difficult round! Get ready to flex those brain muscles, because these questions are going to be tough! Good luck! You got this! Difficult round Number 1. A cube-shaped box is filled with 512 small cubes, each with edges of 1 centimeter. What is the length of one edge of the big box? Again, 
A cube-shaped box is filled with 512 small cubes, each with edges of 1 centimeter. What is the length of one edge of the big box? The choices are A. 6 centimeters B. 8 centimeters C. 16 centimeters D. 32 centimeters The correct answer is B. 8 centimeters. Number 2. A spherical balloon has a radius of 10 centimeters. If air is pumped into the balloon until its radius doubles, by what factor does its surface area increase? Again, a spherical balloon has a radius of 10 centimeters. If air is pumped into the balloon until its radius doubles, by what factor does its surface area increase? The choices are A. 2 B. 4 C. 8 D. 16 The correct answer is B4. Number 3. A large cube is cut into 27 smaller cubes of equal size. How many of the smaller cubes have exactly to faces painted if the large cube was painted on all its faces before being cut? Again, a large cube is cut into 27 smaller cubes of equal size. How many of the smaller cubes have exactly to faces painted if the large cube was painted on all its faces before being cut? The choices are A. 6 B. 12 C. 18 D. 24 The correct answer is B. 12. Number 4. A treasure map uses a scale of 1 to 10,000. If the distance between the starting point and the treasure on the map is 5 centimeters, how far do you need to walk in real life to find the treasure? Again, a treasure map uses a scale of 1 to 10,000. If the distance between the starting point and the treasure on the map is 5 centimeters, how far do you need to walk in real life to find the treasure? The choices are A. 50 meters B. 500 meters C. 5,000 meters D. 50,000 meters The correct answer is B. 500 meters. Number 5. A toy car is built to a scale of 1 to 64. If the actual car is for 0.5 meters long, how long is the toy car in centimeters? Again, a toy car is built to a scale of 1 to 64. If the actual car is for 0.5 meters long, how long is the toy car in centimeters? The choices are A. 7 centimeters. B. 14 centimeters C 28 centimeters D 70 centimeters
The correct answer is A. 7 centimeters. Give yourselves a big round of applause. You've made it through all three rounds of our math quiz challenge. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, share it with your friends, and subscribe to our channel for more awesome learning adventures. Keep those brains buzzing, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! How did you go? Let me know in the comments below how many questions you got right. Check out other videos from BrainWise.